They said they got the big one to work. There it is. They got the big one to work. Wow, that's amazing. Wow, Cohen. Shoes and have some fun. Good morning, guys. It is Monday, and I know we don't normally vlog on Mondays, but we're switching the days again and vlogging today and not tomorrow on Tuesday because Evangeline slept over, and we're excited about that. And we want to vlog the memories of Evangeline being here with us. We were all pretty tired. It is nine o'clock now. We all slept until 8.30 in the morning. Nobody got up until then, not even myself. And I don't, I'm not used to sleeping in that late. I usually get up a lot earlier, but, we, but I'm tired. This girl's tired from, I went, I went for like four or five days straight without a break between co-op or homeschool co-op and then shopping and cleaning for the party and decorating and then yesterday I thought I was gonna rest and I never really did because I did loads tons of loads of laundry in the afternoon instead of resting while the kids were at jumping jacks I decided to videotape three videos for Jewel For Real. I should have rested I could have really used the rest but I also know that I rarely get four ki kids gone in a quiet house in the middle of the day when you have sun natural sunlight pouring in and i like to v tape the videos when there's natural light pouring in and not in, not in the and not late at night and look at what talia made at mom's last week isn't this good i thought that this was pretty good look at the colors and the shadowing yeah so i think this is a keeper we're gonna i'm gonna put this in her homeschool portfolio for the end of the for the end of the year to show the evaluator and I might have to frame this. Before I make breakfast, I made eggs yesterday, so I'm not doing anything elaborate today. Today's cereal day. <laughs> We're taking it easy. Let's go see what the kids are doing. They're all down in the basement. And while I was getting ready, they were in the basement playing. So let's go see what they're doing. What are you guys doing? I'm just Huh? What are you doing under there? Mommy, I just have to do this and then I'm doing English. Oh my word, you're almost done your English already? For homeschooling? Did you sleep over last night again? Yeah? Was it fun? Did you cuddle with Talia in her bed? Yeah, and I watched um, Peppa Pig. Peppa Pig on Ty's Nook. Oh. Just for a little bit this morning, then we went downstairs. Okay. Cohen's now sitting at his desk Mommy, my doing his English. Huh? My belly's growing. Well, let's go eat then. You can take a break to eat, Ty. I'm not that hardcore. See, guys, we have a clean basement again. Look at this. Well, kind of. So, yeah, it's it's clean. We can walk. The, clo the toy closet's clean. We can walk, except for some Legos right here. And... This is all clean. This has not happened in a really long time. Let's go! Since this, okay. Since this is a playroom and stuff. Okay, what are you showing me, Brody? This is the map of the barn. This is the map that they made of the barn. This is a unicorn. Let me see. Who made it? Cohen. Oh, okay. I did most of this. You did that stuff. And Cohen did this stuff, yeah. where he made people and animals. Okay, I, I think that's pretty and cool. And Vanlene's hair is sticking up. Yeah? Look, Vanlene's hair is sticking up. Oh, I see. That's silly. And Cohen did this. All right. Ty and Cohen are going to put, put on a little performance for you. They were going to sing You Are My Sunshine at the birthday party, but then they we forgot completely about it, so now they're going to 
sing it for you guys now because they were practicing together the other day and it was sounded so cute. <laughs> for now, we're done. Gonna do the song. You are my sunshine. You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are gray. You'll never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my what? sunshine away. Please don't take my sunshine away. Oh, you gotta do it one more time. That was so good. No. Ready? That was so cute. Take a bow. Thank you, madam. This is my bow. I may go now. No, no, this is my bow. Whoa. <laughs> We're gonna try a science experiment today since Evangeline's here. Fun! We are good. We actually had some leftover hard-boiled eggs. So we're trying this science experiment because we have hard-boiled eggs that are leftover from Easter last week that are too old to eat now. So I'm like, what do we do with them? Well, before I throw them out, we might as well do some science experiments with them and look up hard-boiled um, egg experiments. So what you wanna do is see, you can see that the egg isn't going through and it's not going to go through at all. Now we're going to see by lighting this piece of newspaper sticking in if it's going to go through. First you got to dip your finger in the water and get the area wet. That's what I saw that you are supposed to do. Okay. And now we're going to try this. Are you guys ready? I'm a little nervous. Brilliant. We're lighting it. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Oh my gosh. Oh, that's dangerous. <laughs> Go, stick the egg on, stick the egg on. Where did you stick the egg on? <laughs> I don't think it's seed lighted long enough. <laughs> Sing. There it goes, there it goes, it's going! <laughs> oh, is it not gonna finish? Oh, is our vase too small? We don't have any ones like that. Go, go, go. Ugh. You know, so we're actually the daddy's gonna get their dad is gonna get a glass container on the way home from work that's gonna actually be able to do that other thing. Take one and take two and take three did not work. So now um, we decided to try. Although we, it's, you're not going to see the results until tomorrow, until tomorrow's log. So we're going to try putting white vinegar into a cup and letting the hard-boiled eggs sit there for a whole day. And what it does is it dissolves the shell because we're going to put it in with the shell, and it's going to dissolve it, and it's going to turn it into a bouncy ball egg with the shell on. Although I cracked it, hopefully, without thinking when the kids were distracting me and crying. Hopefully I didn't ruin the experiment. And then we're gonna pour this vinegar over it. Here is the egg that we used the vinegar. Doesn't it look cool, guys? It is really bubbling. And it is really big. Yeah, it looks big. Yeah, it does. And bouncy. Well, that's because it's unpeeling. It does look huge. Oh my word. It looks huge right now, guys. It's unpeeling the egg. I have Evangeline here, my niece, today. Say hey, Evangeline. Hey. So she's gonna be joining us for a experiment. We're doing something with our magic school bus. We have a magic school bus experiment kit that we haven't even done yet. And so we're gonna do giant bubbles. We're gonna try this. Hopefully this works better than the egg and glass experiment that we tried. So I'm going to dip it in here and measure. Okay, so we did 50 milliliters and then it says do 10 drops of, oh my gosh, I'm not good at size experiments here. 10 drops of uh, liquid soap. Uh, you did 13. I can do it. But it's not going on. Oh my gosh. I give up. I give up on the size of Bye bye science experiment day from Family For Real. This did not work out. Okay, take two. Again, it seems like the, in the Family For Real house, the science experiments always need a second take and a third take. Did you leave? You gotta do it like All right, is this right how their like, things are gonna work out? Whoa! 
Here it's kind of going. Maybe it needs to have more soap in it. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> The amount that they said did not work. You need <laughs> half like soap, half water. <laughs> How big can Cohen make it? Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Let me try again. Finally, some successful science experiments. In the family Faroe house, things take a while. They said they got the big one to work. There it is. They got the big one to work. Wow, that's amazing. Wow, Cohen. Fun. This one can work. Can I pop it? Ready? Let's see how big you can get and make it. Whoa, Cohen. That's one big bubble. <laughs> no! Oh my god! It's <laughs> in the tube. It's raining out, but I things are getting too soapy inside, so I made them come out on the porch to to finish trying their bubbles. There goes Saya. It requires slowness and patience. Don't give it against it, Cohen. No way we put both of our bubbles Stop! together. Don't get against it, Cabrody. Mm. I want it to pop. Well, we'll just wait to see how big it gets first. <laughs> oh, I wanted to put both of us together. Well, is your eyes want to shake? <laughs> this is fun! Wow! Whoa! You got it pretty big before it popped. Can I try? Can I try? Brody's blowing a He's bubble now. Bubble. Look at Brody's big bubble. <laughs> Keep blowing, bud. <laughs> Good job. Wow. That's a big, big bubble. Wow. <laughs> oh my God. Yay! Wow. Randy's acting like my dad. With the, with the cheesy jokes. Ready? Yeah, so we're doing some awesome, crazy experiments with eggs, so I, I channeled uh, my inner father-in-law who would have said something like, oh, I see you're doing some egg experiments. Uh. Yes, that's or something how, like that. Yeah, that's how my dad acts. I will say he has them down pretty good. All right, this is like take 10. I can't even keep track anymore. All right, let's see what happens. I wanna see this crazy fire experiment. Smoke detector's working. Whoa. Whoa! Whoa! Oh my Gosh. word! Oh my word! It took the top part off. <laughs> oh my word! It like sucked it right in. <laughs> All right, that time it worked, guys. Is <laughs> that cool? Is that fun? Yeah, Whoa! Yeah, one more time. Well, you <laughs> there you go. Sorry. Right, here goes again. Ready? We got the flames. Oh! Oh! Ooh. Oh! Whoa! I did it again where it took the thing off. It's like coring the egg. Oh my word! <laughs> <laughs> nice, just suck the whole middle out of it. Well, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to suck the whole thing in. Well, probably because this opening isn't big enough. Yeah, uh, well, you're supposed to, I, I thought you were getting a bigger I think that's cool. Well, there isn't. I think Should that's even cooler. Should we try the shell? I don't think that would work with the shell. Yeah, it wouldn't. All right, Julie's making chili for dinner. And, and it's looking really good. I am a big fan of chili. 
And it's what? It's fairly simple to make, right? Um, well, I like it because it's healthy, but I also fell in the mood for it because it's cold and dreary out. Oh, good point. It is. It's ridiculous. Um, that 80 degree weather just like totally teased us the, the other... Actually, one day this past week and the other days last two weeks ago before that. Oh man, that was just total tease. It wasn't even funny. Now it's back down to it was, it was like 40 degrees when I went to work this morning and windy and rainy and just, just miserable and disgusting. We got Mum Mum here to pick up Evangeline. She's hiding. <laughs> <laughs> She's hiding behind the tablecloth for the bar, away from Mama. Mom. <laughs> she likes it too much at the family for real house. Oh my goodness! You're not behind there. I can see you. Mama is coming for you. Uh oh, 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 oh! Watch out! You might. Supposed to. Evangeline ain't so happy that she's going back. So she loves Mum Mum, she does. But she loves having the four kids in our house and the family for real house to play with when she's here. Nighty night. Staying overnight where? Bye, Mum Mum. Oh. Should we can play with Evangeline. They may be coming on There goes Evangeline. Friday or Thursday. You gonna say bye-bye to Gigi? We can see the world through open eyes And savor all the time before Say bye, Gigi! And every time say you bye. Up, There's a new day that's calling out your name Come join the game Well, that's life Take what comes along the way That's love Let it grow stronger every day There's joy Dreams and fly Together we can try